How are you? This is Sean Bradford with Breathe and Work and Breathe and Sell. So you never, ever want to be labeled as the annoying salesperson. Today I will share with you three tips on how you can be seen and labeled as professional and organized and never ever annoying. So tip number one, biggest valuable tip I can give you is to never conclude a phone discussion or a meeting, basically any contact with a prospect without asking them when you can follow up with them next. This way, you are following up with them per their direction. You will never be labeled as annoying, yet rather as professional and organized. So tip number one, always ask that prospect when you can follow up next. Tip number two, always bring something of value to the table. So whether it's in person, a phone call, an email, you are going to always bring something of value. So annoying salesperson is this. Hey, Mr. Prospect, this is Sean. Are you ready to buy? Or I'm following up. That's annoying. Instead, hey, Mr. Prospect, this is Sean. I came across an article on your industry that I thought you would find fascinating. I'll email it to you now. Let me know you received it. That way, each and every time you contact that prospect, you are associated with value because you're always bringing valuable information, an article they might like, an update to your product, a special on your service that's being run through the end of the year, whatnot. Tip number three, this is a big one. Make sure anytime you call, you're getting chit chat at the end. So you always start with the business. Have you ever had a salesperson call you and they, you know they're calling to sell you something, but they chit chat for five minutes and you're pretty much annoyed for five minutes because you're waiting for the sales pitch. So annoying. Start with the business, go right into that. And then after you can start the chit chat and see how long your client wants to engage that. So to review the three, tip number one is to always ask your client when you can follow up next. That way your client or prospect is directing you when to follow up and you'll be labeled as professional and organized, not annoying. Tip two is never ever just call and say I'm following up. Always have something of value to share with them. And tip number three again is to always start with business and then go to chit chat. Never start with chit chat. If you like this, please let us know with a comment below. Also subscribe to our channel. We'd so appreciate that. You can receive a worksheet at our website, breatheandwork.com, or click the link below that will help you get really clear on all the ways you can follow up without being annoying and be actual value. So click that link below. It'll take you right to the website. Thank you so much for watching. Check you out here next time. Bye-bye.